All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of The Strength Classroom. Today I'm showing you my maximum effort lower body workout and I decided to go along with, well not decided, I have a cycle going, sumo deadlifts with bands, uh, working up to a three rep max. And uh, it went better than I thought because I'm not really that great at sumo and I changed my stance slightly. I brought it in a little bit, which has helped. I feel like it was just too wide before. And I do like wide sumo deadlifts as an assistance movement, but I think trying to go super heavy on them was silly for my build. So I went to 405 plus roughly 75 pounds of band. It was probably more actually, I didn't measure them. But um, this was great. Actually, my form looks crisp. Everything is good. It worked up to a nice triple. My sleep was actually horrible the night before. Went to bed too late, but this I'm pleased with this. Super solid lift. And sometimes not going to a complete max can help you in the long run. Then, this is probably my last week of doing this. Low box squats to a low box with the safety squat bar, 240 pounds. This is a great lift for both your squat and deadlift. Taxes your upper back, taxes your legs, taxes your core. What else could you want? I worked up to three sets of 10, and I would give this a shot. Even if you don't have a safety squat bar, you can maybe do front squats to a low box. It would have the same effect. You, If you have any other specialty bar, such as a cambered bar or a buffalo bar, or even a straight bar, just the fact that it's a low box with a close stance, make sure your mobility is good. You don't want to snap yourself up. But uh, it's great. I would try this. Even if you don't have this exact setup that I have, I would give this a shot as well. As you can see, my upper back is really struggling at this point. Then I did safety squat bar good mornings with 200 pounds. I have to rework the way I do good mornings. I just don't know. They're just not feeling... Uh, it's not that they're not feeling right. I feel like I can make them feel better. And if anyone has any ideas, please let me know. I just feel like I can... They used to feel better. Something has been happening somewhere along the way where they don't feel as beneficial to me as they once did. I got to look at my old uh, video logs and workouts and clips and just see what has changed because they used to feel much, much better. Or maybe it's just me. And then I did some heavy kettlebell swings, 125 pounds for four sets of 25. I did these with really strict rest, about one minute rest. And uh, these are great. Great for the glutes, great for the hamstrings, even good for the grip because it's slightly heavier and just the way it is, it's such a narrow grip. And good for conditioning too because you get to do these really quick and you really can't rest. If you rest, the set's over. And then I did some cardio with my weighted vest. I had to speed it up just so you even see me in the frame. I'm going to be doing a review on this vest. It is the best weighted vest I've ever used in my life. And uh, it's quite pricey, but you'll get to that in the review. So if you like this video, please click that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Share the videos with your friends if you think they'll like them as well. If you have a question for me, drop in the comments. And as always, class is dismissed.